Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Amanda Lamarty and I am your online stylist. Before we get into the video, make sure you are subscribed and click the notification bell so you never miss an upload. Today's video should be on the shorter side as long as I don't get sidetracked and ramble on, but it is three easy ways to spice up your fall and winter outfits. So me in particular, I live in a climate that we get a ton of snow. It's in the teens, the 20s, when it's winter time. So I'm always in jackets and you know, you have to bundle up, you have to layer, but that does not mean you cannot be cute in the process. So this is going to kind of be a trailer or like a teaser also. I'm gonna be doing like a full like outerwear haul as well coming soon. So one of the pieces that I will have in that video is going to make an appearance in this one. So as you can see, I am in my little fall slash winter get up. I have on this like really cute, um, this is from Just Fab. I got it on sale for like $5. That's what, if you want to add some more pieces in your wardrobe for the upcoming months, I know how to find the deals. So just throwing that out there. But this is from Just Fab. This is loft i got it at fell at mall for like 12 dollars and then the boots i did a little review on recently and then i i shouldn't be turning around I, it looks great from the front but i just like tied a little thing because i didn't I don't have a bra on so i didn't want to like tuck under it was a whole thing so i just have it tied so it looks good from this angle but we're gonna get into the video so number one is going to be drum roll please bright colored nails I bet you weren't expecting that. So I recently went to the LA pop-up for Undone Lacquer. It is Machine Gun Kelly's nail polish line. And also his partner is Candy Harris as well for this, which I just learned this weekend. I'm obsessed. And I know that sounds biased because you guys know I'm a huge Machine Gun Kelly fan, but the nail polish is fantastic. I was always somebody who went for like the cheapest nail polish I could find, but there is something to be said when you invest even in nail polish. So I was super excited too, because I had some of his colors, the colors from the line before, but I hadn't yet tried like the top coat. And I just redid them as soon as I got home. The same day I like painted my nails this really pretty. This was the electric green from the set. Um, so these beautiful neons are perfect for adding a little pop of color in your wardrobe. I'm in a very neutral black and tan outfit. And then I just have like this little wow on my fingertips. So. Super excited, and if you watched my fall and winter trends prediction video, I said that dopamine dressing was gonna be huge, which is just wearing like bright colors in the fall and winter, so this is such an easy, inexpensive way to kind of get on that trend train. I was for a long time getting just like the gel manicures, but I have like a little bit of um, commitment issues because you really like, I would go roughly like once a month, so, you know, if you've ever gotten nails, gel nails done, it's a process. You have to soak them and like to get them off this. The wear I've noticed has been really good, not chipping. And if I want to take it off and change the color because I need it to match my outfit, I just take it off with nail polish. So it was just, I'm, I'm on the like regular nail polish trend again, especially if you get a high quality nail polish that will last you that's not going to be chipping right away so i highly recommend checking out undone lacquer the pop-up was so cute you could get your nails done there and there was like merch and obviously like all these different um little sets that you could buy or you could make like a custom one but i wanted this one because you couldn't get these colors when you're doing your own custom one so i had to get the bigger set obviously but love it love this brand definitely check it out Number two is statement sunglasses. I'm sure if you've been up to date on my videos, you've noticed that I, in particular, have been loving these sunglasses. I don't know why I never really thought of it before. Like, obviously, bright, like, Elton John was onto something when he was like, let me just wear these awesome, cool, creative, fashionable sunglasses all the time. Because it really does add a new layer, a new little, like, spicy element to your wardrobe. And this is another really inexpensive way to do that so both of these were on amazon i believe they were both under ten dollars if not under twelve dollars so i got these guys like these are giving me lady gaga like i'm just i turned around again you saw my scratchy but ignore that but these are so cute and then with this particular outfit i've already filmed a reel and this is the 
the glasses that goes with this outfit I'm thinking so yeah that's my number two tip again just super inexpensive I even got I'll show you from the store five below these little like five dollar pink sunglasses my hair is stuck to my lip gloss but like so easy and like Obviously it's a good outfit without, but then this is just making me, it's giving me like a cooler edge to the outfit, especially biased to these with the outfit. And these actually come in different, they have like a tortoise frame and then like different color lenses. I'm like, do I need another one? I can hold off for now, but again, the point is inexpensive eyewear or expensive eyewear, whatever you want, but in general eyewear. And then like I mentioned in the beginning of the video, this is a little teaser for what's to come for the statement outerwear I'm gonna be filming the video, but this is just a beautiful statement jacket. This is a shearling, oh, shearling lined aviator jacket I picked up on Amazon. I've been eyeing this up for over a year, so I'm just so happy she's finally in my presence, in my closet, on my clothing rack, in my office, so I can stare at her all day. But a statement jacket is, like jackets, coats are not, for just fashion where I live, we get tons of snow, it's freezing, like I said before, so you need to wear a jacket. And a lot of the times I just find myself throwing on, even if I'm going somewhere nice, just like my big puffer jacket, which is fine, it's cute, but if you get a really fashionable statement jacket, you can again match it to the outfit and then add a whole new layer. So it's not like you have to open the jacket, take it off to show people your outfit. It's like, this is an element of the outfit and a lot of the times when i'm just like running into the store or like out with my mom during the winter we leave our jackets on so then no one even gets to see my outfit and it kind of makes me sad and i feel like i get a little fashion depression i don't know if that's a thing but i get fashion depression in the winter because i feel less inspired because i have to dress practically where i currently live with like boots and you know be warm so you're not freezing going from the car and you don't want to fall on the ice so you need like grippy boots that's why watch that video these have like great traction if you're looking for a good cute winter boot but so here's this added to the outfit and let me throw on the glasses really quick so there's the full look and now i'm hiding my little scrunchie in the back so that's it three easy inexpensive ways to add a little, I keep saying spice, what's another word? Add a little flair to your fall and winter wardrobe. So like I said, that was just a quick little video. It was just on my heart, it popped in my mind. So I was like, I better just film this now. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching. Remember you can work with me one-on-one. -on -one. I actually have a new full like rebranding yourself package, like how to align yourself, mind, body, spirit, and wardrobe currently up on my website. So there's a link to that in the description box. Thank you guys so much again for watching and I'll talk to you soon.